Ghostbusters crew fans, it's Rocco and I'm here at Six Flags Mid-America near St. Louis to ride Windseeker. It, oh wait. Hey Ghostbusters crew fans, it's Rocco and I'm here at Six Flags Mid-America near St. Louis to ride Skyflyer. Hey Coaster Crew fans, I'm here at Six Flags Mid-America near St. Louis in Eureka, Missouri to ride Sky Screamer. And out of all these high swing rides, this one is up there. I'm telling you, 23 stories high. Goes about 35, 40 miles an hour and it is exciting. It's got the chains, not like the Mondale Windseeker where it's uh, got a hard stem on it. Uh, makes it a little more exciting for me. Although the most dangerous and scary one I've ever ridden was at the Minnesota State Fair where the base turned. And that was pretty scary considering that there's a moving part at the base of such a tall ride. So we're going to go check out American Thunder and see what else is going on in St. Louis. Talk to you later. Index finger, engage. Grasp your fright light. Is that what the kids are calling it now? Here we are outside American Thunder, formerly Evil Knievel. My favorite ride in the park. And probably my number three with the poster. Why? GCI, baby. You know what? I love Adam House. And I think about Adam House when I'm riding American Thunder. Guess what? I'm riding American Thunder right now. And here's all the new signage for American Thunder. No more evil can evil feats and great legendary jumps, but new trivia and little factoids about some of the classic coasters out there. Leap the Dips, Rocket, Knobles, Ace. Not only is it not called Tony Hawk anymore, the autograph is gone. <laughs> All right, we're calling it a day at Six Flags Mid America near St. Louis. It was a hot one today. 106 earlier, heat index was 110. Right now it's 96 degrees. I'm full of sweat, feel like a scumbag. I uh, had a great day though, good rides, barely any lines, so come out here, check out Sky Screamer, and we'll check you on the show Monday night at 8 o'clock. Talk to you later, Coast Crew, bye. Index finger, engage.